Well, hello, this is Game Over Boy. Today I'll be pitch bending a chat and count smartphone. I took it apart. I've been looking for the resistor. I found it. It's resistor 12. What you can do is just wet your finger and while it's playing music. Now that I found the resistor, that's resistor 12, I'm going to connect a cable to it and then connect that to this potentiometer and then put it in the back of the phone. Now I should be able to change it to pitch by tying the knob. I've discovered from the past that the best thing to do is get a little mill connector, bend it a little so it's downwards and place it on the resistor. Just like that. It fits perfect. But if you use normal wire, everything starts burning up, as I found out. Fire! What do I do? What do I do? <coughs> oh, the song! The song! When a fire starts to burn, there's a lesson you must learn. Something, something, then you'll see. You'll avoid catastrophe. Stop! So, as you can see, we have placed the connector on the board, that, making that touch a resistor. We've also glued it down so it's more secure. We've wired everything together. We've made it so when you turn this switch on and off, it turns pitch mode on and off, just like the Mayan Leap Top. And when you turn this knob, it changes the pitch, also like the Mayan Leap Top. The grey cable from the centre of the switch goes to the pitch resistor. Then the switch tells if current goes with this one or not. It goes into the data input of this potentiometer. But the 5 volt and the ground of the potentiometer go to the 5 volt and ground of the phone. Because there's no room for the potentiometer, it's going to be outside of it like this. And the switch is going to be put in there. One hour later. We finished the project, but sadly we put the potentiometer in the wrong place, but it still works. Now you can hear all the sounds. Well, what it does. Yeah. Hope you've enjoyed this video. See you soon in the next one. Bye! Wow. <laughs>